Okay, let's see if this works. Hi Sam, everybody, it's Sam from Crash Course Emma here. This is just a quick video update telling you what's been happening behind the scenes. Firstly, technical problems. It's a hardware issue. It wasn't the cable, turns out it's my computer and it's USB ports. Here's a picture of how good my computer slash toaster actually is. <laughs> Secondly, here's what we've been working on behind the scenes. Firstly, Fabris's secret technique with the rapier against a pole arm. Did a whole video on that. That was great fun. Can't upload it though because the computer is foobar. In order to do that video, I naturally had to make an actual pole arm. Here's a Mandanke bamboo quarter staff made in three sections that I made for that video. Seven foot long, a little bit short for me, not too bad. But I made a making of video for it as well. Thirdly, my thoughts on Polish Sabre. This isn't a Polish Sabre. This is a hanger, or maybe at best a cutlass. This thing. Bronze Swords. Did a whole bronze sword review. This is of course a Neil Burbridge, which is very hard to get. So we've got that coming as well. Recycling! We took this bashed up old Darkwood Armoury late period English basket hilt, cut it to pieces because it was absolutely smashed, and now we're trying to curl it into a George Silver-esque early Tudor Mary Rose Thames River style basket hilt in order to match this beautiful parrying dagger, also from Darkwood Armouries. Subsequently, George Silver's back sword and dagger section did a whole video on that as well. Other sword reviews, like this uh, Darkwood Armoury basket hilt mounted to a big broad back sword blade, or the Saviolo Special, we have a few of those as well. And a couple of casual antiques that I installed. Thank you everybody for all your support and everything. I also realised that we had a little bit of a milestone recently and I made a video for that, which I can't upload because my computer is cracked. But thank you everyone, stick around, we're going to be bringing stuff out shortly, but I'm currently unemployed. Woo! Finding work is hard and getting money is tough. But we're going to make it happen. Thanks for your support. I'll see you guys next time.